If you're following Depp and Heard and events around them, things like that, you might know people here is usually very positive on Amber. So when they report on Johnny that's not really related to Amber, I like to check it out. So it says, Johnny Depp appears in trailer for 2023 Carvoy Vari Film Festival during events opening ceremony from July 1st, 2023. Let's see what we got. Johnny Depp makes an appearance in the new trailer for this year's Carvoy Vari Film Festival, which debuted at Friday's opening ceremony. So once again, we got Johnny doing things again in the industry. Not exactly Hollywood, but in the industry. Directed by Ivan Zak and set in Hotel Garrett in Budapest, the trailer features What's Eating Gilbert Grape actor entering the hotel to sit down for an interview with a guitar case in hand. I don't know where they get What's Eating Gilbert Grape actor. I mean, they could pick any movie Johnny was in, but it should be the biggest and the one the most people know. I would just say Jack Sparrow or Pirates of Caribbean actor, but all right. After, he's asked a personal question about why he didn't receive an award the last time he was at the festival, and Depp replies, we're here to talk about music, really, before pulling a trophy out of his guitar case. The on-screen appearance in which Depp pokes fun at himself comes two years after the actor was the festival's guest of honor in 2021, when he presented two films he produced, Crock of Gold and Minamata. And by the way, not for nothing, it's always good to see people make fun of themselves. I just find that a quality I like. I try to do it too once in a while. Festival organizers first teased the depth trail in May, and the event's executive director, Christophe Mucha, said per THR that it turned out great. Two years ago, Giant Depp received an immensely warm welcome from audiences and fans, thanks to which he has become a great supporter of ours. And so he agreed to film a trailer even though we were limited by his packed schedule. The trailer turned out great. And I'm convinced that Johnny Depp will one day return to Vari in person. So, they report pretty nice on Johnny. Nothing bad to say, no smear, no bad twist. But then, for the rest of the article, for some reason, they mention Amber. They give the basic facts of the trial. Okay. And then this. Earlier this week, Heard shared a photo of herself on stage at the 69th Taramina Film Festival in Italy, which she attended for a movie in the fire. Okay. They add some very positive quotes about Amber. But wait, I thought this was a positive article about Johnny. That's the headline. And then just a little bit later, we get a lot about Amber and related articles all about Amber. So is people actually reporting good on Johnny here? Kind of. For about the first two pages or so. But either way, it seems like people is really set on all this incredible positivity about Amber. I mean, just look at this. There's no negativity. There's nothing at all that would make you think, this here's a person who committed perjury in Australia and was found guilty of defamation. No, nope, just smiley, smiley, smiley. Check this out. Check that out. So can I even give them 50% on this one? Like, 50% reporting Johnny, and then after that, shoeholing in Amber? I don't know. I kind of give them like 30% on this one, because it feels like they just use this headline to then promote you know who. But at least it's not all negative and all untrue smear and things like that. I guess some people in People have to actually report some news once in a while that's not all narrative. Anyway, I'll be following the media, seeing what's going on, seeing where the tide is going, but it's definitely not turning. We shall see. If you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you don't, I'll be real sad about it, but I'll get over it. See you next time.